Hey guys, so yeah, we're going to my Matt's, uh, Matt's Frenchies and today I'm just going to be talking to you guys pretty much uh, how to avoid scams when it comes with buying a dog. Ooh. Because <laughs> there are scammers and there are bad people in this world. So just going to be teaching you guys uh, three rules or three tips to follow when it comes with uh, uh, buying a dog, buying a new dog especially. You know, they could be pricey. But um, yeah, let's get right into it. So uh, yeah, first rule. Uh, that I can say is pretty much having paperwork for the dog and paperwork you know it's really important too because it, it determines the legitimacy of the dog is that going to work yeah but it determines if the dog's legit and it can show the lineage or the DNA paperwork or the background of the dog and you know paperwork is just really important and to even add with that with paperwork you know make sure the paperwork's under uh, like a big organization such as AKC or UKC or CKC and uh, yeah those those are the main ones so um, yeah that's uh, that's really important you know when it comes with uh, buying a dog you want to have that paperwork too so yeah so that's my uh, my first rule and then the second rule that I can say is to uh, ask pictures of the parents or um, FaceTime them dude you you could uh if you could FaceTime them or you can even go over the place or hold up actually let me rephrase that if you could FaceTime them first to uh, make sure it's legit you know uh I'd be okay me as a breeder I, I'm okay with uh, FaceTiming you every breeder should be okay well that I hope I hope every breeder should be okay with FaceTime you know just to check that it's legit you know especially you you want to FaceTime them to to see the puppy or just see the dog that they have and uh see the parents too so um it, you know if they don't want to facetime with it uh i guess most of the time it's probably a scam so you you'd want to do that so second rule just uh facetime them or uh see the dog in person before you make that big purchase so yeah second rule and then the uh, third rule that i can say is you know follow your gut or follow your intuition man you know, you you want to to see how the dog looks, right? And then just look up how you know whatever type of breed that you're going for or you're trying to buy. Uh, with me, I, I breed French Bulldogs, and you know French Bulldogs have those ha they have those bat ears. So instead of the pointy like the pointy ears, they're like more like round, more round. <laughs> if I even make that right, but um. Yeah, or German Shepherds, they don't have that like full white chest. It's more like a blended white or it's more, they don't even have the white chest at all too, like Pet Bulls or French Bulldogs or any other type of dog that has that. But yeah, um, that's that's pretty much it. Just uh, my third rule to follow. But um, also, is there anything extra tips that I can add? Um, oh, also guys, be, be wary with the first rule that I say with paperwork too. Because um, I can just say like this dog comes from that I can like I can legit I can print out a French Bulldog AKC paperwork and say that yeah this is uh this is my paperwork for this French Bulldog be careful of that so make sure that the paperwork's legit too and also you know just make it more uh convenient with YouTube so yeah just uh I think that's pretty much it with uh, my three rules or three tips to follow when it comes with uh buying a dog and make sure it's not a scam and uh yeah uh because i just bought a dog recently too and um i'll show him up right here roach and uh, he will be available for stud uh, soon he's still kind of young so um he will be available for stud uh just let me know or uh comment uh on the sections below and uh yeah i'll let you know how much uh the stuff he is gonna be and uh yeah thank you guys so much for uh listening and hope you guys learn from that so don't get scammed and be safe and fuck those scammers honestly so love you guys to deuces <laughs> hey guys forgot to mention uh hit that subscribe button and like the button is that how you say it i'm not really sure how to say it in youtube i think i think that's that's how you say it i'm so uh, I, I don't know but just just hit that <laughs> but um yeah guys uh, i'll be making more videos pretty much uh soon in the future and uh, hopefully I'll be more consistent about it and try to make it a commitment. So we'll do that. So peace out, guys. Love y'all.